Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Ted Line Gymnasium. Senior boys basketball action between the visiting Paris Eagles and your hometown Danville Little Johns. As we get the ball game underway. Danville's first possession, have a whistle. Charging foul, player control foul against number 42, Tanner Mantooth. He'll be joined by number 12, Jay Trusty. Number two is Steven Ramirez. Number 10 is Grant Cathy. And number 24 is Mackenzie Garner. That is your senior boys on the floor as Mackenzie Garner blocks the shot, picks up the loose ball. Little Johns with the ball. Want to thank ArcWest Communications, Chambers Memorial Hospitals, Chambers Bank, and the First Baptist Church Youth Ministries for being our sponsors tonight, for allowing us to bring these boys to your TV. Whistle traveling violation as his pivot foot slid down the floor. Seven minutes left. We've played a minute. No score here at Ted Line Gymnasium. Steven Ramirez running one-hander no good. Eagles out. Push the ball down the floor. Whistle and the foul before the shot. On Tanner Mantooth. That's his second. As Kevin Dominguez checks into the ball game for Tanner Mantooth, Tanner picks up two quick personal fouls. He has to go to the bench. There's Banks it in, takes a two point lead with 6.20. Remaining here in the first period. <laughs> Whistle and a foul. We'll send Ke Kevin Dominguez to the line. He'll go to the line to shoot a pair of free throws. 6.03 remaining here in the opening period. Senior boys, basketball action. Kevin knocks down the first free throw. He picks up Danville's first points of the ball game. As the second rolls out, ball knocked out of bounds by McKenzie Garner. goes out of bounds. Little John's with the ball, 547 remaining here in the opening period. Two to one's your score. Steal by the Eagles. They'll push the ball down the floor. Pull up jumper won't go. Rebound, Steven Ramirez. He'll give it to Grant Cathy. Grant will push it up, loses the handle on the ball. Whistle and a foul as Jay Trusty makes a steal. We've got a timeout, Paris, after the timeout. Again, Jay Trusty made a steal. 
Whistle and a foul was called on the Paris Eagles. Each team now has two team fouls. Jay Trusty drives, lays it up and in. That's his first points of the night. Danville leads with 5.05 remaining here in the opening period. Three to two. Ball knocked away by Jay Trusty, picked up by Grant Cathy. Whistle and a foul is going to be called on the Eagles. The little John will inbound the ball on the sideline. McKenzie Garner for two. Five to two is your score. Little John's lead by three with 4.25 remaining. Want to thank ArcWest Communication for being one of our sponsors tonight. Not just your local phone company, but they have internet TV. Go by and see one of the ladies at the Customer Care Center. Or vis visit us on our website, www.arcwest.com. Give us a call at 495 4200. If you've got a phone need, an internet need, or a TV need, give us a call. And see what we can do. Arquest Communications. Whistle and a foul as Jay Trusty drives. His ba basket will count. He'll go to the line. Shooting one free throw. Rolls in and out. Four minutes remaining. Seven to two is your score. Steven Ramirez comes out of there with the ball. He'll push it up the floor. McKenzie's shot will not go. Whistle and a foul. Going to be called on Kevin Dominguez. That's his first personal foul, team foul number three. Three minutes, 35 seconds remaining here in the opening period. Danville leading, visiting Paris Eagles, seven to two. Make that seven to four after that basket. Long outlet pass by the Eagles. Their layup good, 7-6 is your score. Three minutes remaining here in the opening period. Whistle and a foul. Little John inbound the ball from the sideline. Get it inbound to Jay Trusty. Pass inside to Steven Ramirez. His shot won't go. McKenzie Garner with the rebound. His putback won't go. Paris pushes the ball down the floor. Now they'll slow it up and set up their offense. Two minutes, 30 seconds remaining here in the opening period. Pass inside, batted away by Steven Ramirez, picked up by Grant Cathy. Kevin Dominguez for three. 10 to six is your score with 2.05 remaining here in the opening period. Little John's leading by four as Kevin Dominguez makes a steal. He'll go for the layup. His shot blocked out of bounds. Body contact. It will send Kevin Dominguez to the line shooting a pair of free throws.
Kevin's first shot off the front of the rim, no good. One minute, 59 seconds remaining here in the opening period. Senior boys basketball action again between the Danville Little Johns and the visiting Paris Eagles as Kevin knocks down one of two free throws. Eleven to six is your score. Eleven to eight. Jay Trusty for three won't go. Rebound. Stephen Ramirez. His sh shot will not go. Whistle and a foul. Whistle and a foul going to be called against the Paris Eagles. For holding sins. trying to make sure they get the right guy shooting free throws. Grant, Kathy goes to the line shooting a one and one. Grant misses the free throw. Steven Ramirez chases down the rebound. Clears back out top to Grant Kathy. He'll give it to Jay Trusty and they'll set up the offense. Jay Trusty pass to McKenzie Garner off the board. Good. Thirteen to eight, your score with just under a minute to play. Matter of fact, down to forty-five seconds. Shot missed by the Eagles. Stephen Ramirez with the rebound. Kevin Dominguez will walk it in the front court. Little Johns will milk some time off the clock, look for the last second shot. As Kevin Dominguez knocks another three down with 15 seconds remaining in the opening period. 16 to eight, your score. Whistle and a foul. Gonna be called on Steven Ramirez. That's his first, team's fourth. 3.2 seconds remaining here in the opening period. Jay Trusty knocks the ball away. Kevin Dominguez is shot at the buzzer, blocked out of bounds. We'll end the first period. Danville leading 16 to eight over the Paris Eagles. Welcome back to Ted Line Gymnasium. Second period action, senior boys basketball between the visiting Paris Eagles in your hometown, Danville, Little Johns. Little Johns ended the first period leading 16 to eight as Jay Trusty comes out of there with the rebound. Early in the first period, Tanner Mantooth picked up two quick fouls. He had to go to the bench. Kevin Dominguez came in for him. Done a good job, actually scored eight points of the 16 in the first period. As Terry Puthabong checks in, he'll replace Steven Ramirez. So we have Terry Puthabong, number one. Number 42 is Tanner Mantooth. Number 24 is Mackenzie Garner. Number 23 is Kevin Dominguez. And number 12 is Jay Trusty. Inbound pass to Mackenzie. His shot, no good. The Eagles get the rebound. The 
Eagles slowing things up a bit here, starting out the second period a little slower than the first period was. Fast paced, up and down the court. Ball knocked out of bounds by Tanner Mantu. Paris will inbound it underneath their own basket, trailing by eight with 6.34 remaining here in the second period. As the Eagles cut the lead to six. Whistle and a foul. Send Jay Trusty to the line shooting a pair. free throws. Gives the little Johns back at eight point advantage. Traveling violation called on the Eagles. 6.08 remaining, 18 to 10 is your score. Jay Trusty's three won't go. Kevin Dominguez gets a rebound. His shot up won't go. Battle for the rebound. Jay Trusty comes out of there with it. His pass goes out of bounds. Eagles ball. 5.43 remaining. Tanner Mantooth with the rebound. Whistle and a foul. Little Johns will inbound the ball from under the eagle basket. Tanner will walk to the other end. of the, He'll go to the line shooting a one and one. Again, Tanner didn't get to see much action in the first period as he picked up two Two fouls in the first minute and a half of the ball game and had to sit for most of the first quarter. Tanner misses the free throw. Rebound chased down by McKenzie Garner. He'll be called for the offensive foul. That's his first, team's fifth. Kevin Dominguez with the steal. He goes the length of the floor. His shot up, no good. Whistle and a foul. Kevin will go to the line shooting two free throws. Five minutes, 15 seconds remaining here in the second period as Kevin knocks down the first one. Grant. Kathy and Steven Ramirez check back into the ball game for your little Johns. Jay Trusty and Tanner Mantooth take a seat. Kevin misses his second, but a lane violation called against the Eagles will give him another opportunity. And he makes them pay by knocking that free throw down, extending the that little John lead 20 to 10.
Five minutes remaining here in the second period. Whistle and Mackenzie Garner picks up his second. Personal foul, that's the team sixth is number four. Toby Morrison will check into the ball game. McKenzie will take a seat as he's got two. Twenty to ten is your score. With four minutes and forty seconds remaining here in the Second period, whistle and a foul is going to be called on Kevin Dominguez. That's his second. Team seventh. That sends Paris to the line shooting a one and one as Jade Trusty checks back into the ball game. Brother Logan Ferguson at First Baptist Church. He's their youth minister. He's leading the youth and he says, their youth meet every Wednesday evening from 5.30 to 7. He says, come and experience a time of worship and biblical teaching that can change your life. Students 7th through the 12th grades can experience camps, mission trips, and many other fun activities. Go by and visit and see Brother Logan and the youth there at the First Baptist Church here in Danville as we have a timeout, Danville. After the timeout, Danville will inbound the ball, leading by nine. 22 at 11 is your score. Your senior boys on the floor. Number one, Terry Puthavong is his shot up, will not go, gets his own rebound, dishes it off to Jay Trusty, his shot good. So number 12 is Jay Trusty. Number one is Terry Puthavong. Number 10 is Grant Cathy. Number two is Steven Ramirez. And number four is Toby Morrison. That's your little Johns. Traveling violation against the little Johns. 359 remaining, leading by 11. 22 to 11 is your score. Danville extending their defense. Terry Puthavong with the steal. His layup good. Extending the little John lead to 13, 24 to 11. Eagles get their rebound off their own miss, lay it back up. Good, 24 to 13 is your score, three minutes. 20 seconds remaining here in the second period. Grant Cathy pulls them up, slows them down a little bit, sets the offense up. Terry Puthvong at the top of the offense. Grant Cathy's three. Whistle and a foul is going to be called on Jay Trusty. That's his first. Team's eighth. That will send the Eagles to the line, shooting a one and one. Tanner Mantu, the check back into the ball game for your little Johns. He'll replace Terry Puthavong. As the Eagles knock down the first three. Free throw. They knock down both of them. Steven Ramirez gets the ball in. They push it up to Grant Cathy. Grant Cathy's pass stolen away by the Eagles.
Tanner Mantooth with the rebound. He'll push it up the floor. Gives it off Steven Ramirez. Over to Jay Trusty. Line whistling foul called against Paris. We'll send Jay to the line. Shooting a pair of free throws as the Eagles have committed 10 team fouls here in the first half. Putting the Little Johns in the double bonus. Jay makes one of two. Whistle, offensive fouls the call against the Eagles. Little John's looking to extend a 10 point lead. Tanner Mantooth loses a handle on the ball. He's tied up position. Their old belongs to the Little Johns. They'll inbound it from underneath their basket. Little Johns get it inbound, swing it around the horn, Jay Trusty. Steven Ramirez, shot, will not go. Whistle and a foul is going to be called on number four, Toby Morrison. That'll be his first. Eagles knock down both free throws, making the score 25 to 17. Eight point advantage for the Little Johns with one minute, 30 seconds remaining here in the first half of senior boys basketball action. Pass stolen away by the Eagles. Whistle and a foul. Going to be Kevin uh, Tanner Mantooth. It's going to be called for his third personal foul. Terry Puthavong comes to the scorer's table. He'll replay, check into the ball game, replacing Tanner Mantooth. Jay, trustee with the rebound. One minute, 10 seconds remaining here in the first half. Rebound, Eagles off the Jay, trustee missed. Whistle and a foul is going to be called. Oh, 
That foul was called on Grant Cathy. That's his first. As the Eagles make one of two, 25 to 18 is your score. 40 seconds remaining here in the opening half. Ball stolen away by the Eagles. They'll push it down the floor. Layup no good. Jay Trusty with the rebound. Whistle and a foul called against the Eagles. We'll send Jay Trusty to the line with 16.8 seconds remaining here in this opening half. Jay goes to the line, shooting a pair of free throws. Jay makes one of two. Makes the score 26 to 18. Danville leading by. Toby Morrison comes out of there with it. He pushes it up the floor to Grant Cathy. Last second shot by Terry Boothbong won't go, but they'll go into the halftime leading 26 to 18 over the Paris Eagles. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, Ted Lyon Gymnasium. Senior boys basketball action between the visiting Paris Eagles and your hometown Danville Little Johns. Danville went in at halftime leading 26 to 18. That three point basket by the Eagles cut it to 26 to 15. 26-21 your score. Five point lead by the Little Johns. Little Johns, Mackenzie Garner for two. Jay Trusty comes out with a missed shot. He pushes it all the way down. His layup no good. Eagles rebound. Leading scores for your little Johns at halftime were Kevin Dominguez and Jay Trusty both had 10 apiece. Mackenzie Garner added four and Terry Puthabong had two. Your little John's on the floor starting this second half here in the third quarter. Number 12 is Jay Trusty. Number 24, Mackenzie Garner. Number 10 is Grant Cathy. 23 is Kevin Dominguez. And number two is Steven Ramirez. We've got a whistle and a timeout, Danville. And after that shot, it's down to a three point ball game. Danville takes a timeout. Dusty tries to settle them down a little bit. 28-25's your score. Kevin Dominguez drives, kicks it out to Mackenzie Garner. His shot no good. Eagles get the rebound. They'll push it down the floor. They go hard to the basket. That layup good. It's a one-point ball game. 28-27. Five minutes, 30 seconds. Remaining here in the third period, another steal by the Eagles. 
That layup gives them the lead, 29-28. Whistling and foul against the Eagles. That's their first this half. Jay Trusty drives and puts it in the hole. Gives the little Johns back the lead by one, 30 to 29 is your score. Steven Ramirez with the rebound. Gavin Dominguez sets up the Little John offense. He'll give it to Grant Cathy. Back to Kevin inside to McKenzie. His drive, his shot up no good. Boy, it's Solana foul. Going to be called on Steven Ramirez. That's his second. After a little bit of confusion. On, foul was on the rebound. Three-point basket by the Eagles give them a two-point advantage. Timeout taken by Danville's Jay Trusty. After the timeout, Little John's inbound the ball, push it up the floor. Kevin Dominguez over to McKenzie Garner. His shot up won't go. He'll go to the line shooting a pair of free throws. When you deal with the bank, you want to deal with someone that you know and trust. Chambers Bank in Danville is just that bank. Chambers Bank's a longtime supporter of the community and is proud to sponsor the Danville Little Johns. Chambers Bank, member FDIC, equal housing lender, serving the area for over 75 years. Chambers Bank, one of our fine sponsors, making this production possible. As McKenzie Garner knocks down both free throws, Ties this ball game back up with four minutes remaining here in the third period. Eagles get the rebound off their missed shot, put it back in the hole, they lead by two. Ball knocked away, picked up by the Eagles. Eagles again get their rebound off their missed shot. They lead by four, 36-32. Whistle and a foul. Going to be called on Jay Trusty. Offensive foul. That's his second. Team second. Eagles inbound the ball, leading by four with three minutes, 10 seconds remaining here in the third period. Layup no good, McKenzie Garner with the rebound. 
Kevin Dominguez pushes the ball up, kicks it out to Jay Trusty. His three won't go. Rebound Eagles. No, oh, Kevin Dominguez gets in there, strips the ball away, throws it off one of the Eagles players, out of bounds, Dantonville possession. Great hustle by Kevin Dominguez. Whistle and a foul is going to be called on the inbounds pass. Little Johns will inbound it again. Little Johns get it, give it, get it in to Stephen Ramirez. His pass knocked away, intended for McKenzie Garner. Then McKenzie on the other end gets the pass. Gives the ball back to the Little Johns. They'll set it up as whistle. Player control foul. Against Jay Trusty. That's his third. have it with 215. Whistle and a foul is going to be called against the Little Johns. Tanner Mantooth, that is his fourth personal foul. Team foul number four here in the third period. It's Paris Knocks down a three. Whistle and a foul. And Steven Ramirez checks into the ball game, replacing Tanner Mantu. 39-32 is your score, 2.04 remaining. Whistle and a foul on Paris. That's their 15th foul, 159 remaining. Johns get it inbound, stop the key, Grant Cathy. Grant Cathy's joined by Kevin Dominguez, number 23. Number 12 is Jay Trusty. Number two is Steven Ramirez. Number 24 is Mackenzie Garner. Traveling violations, the call against the Eagles. One thirty remaining here in the third period. 39-32 is your score. Paris Eagles leading by seven. Pushes it up the floor, decides to set it up. Jay Trusty with the rebound off the miss. Just under a minute left here in the third period. Jay Trusty drives and scores. belongs to
Jay Trusty drives, kicks it out to Mackenzie Gardner. His shot won't go. Rebound, Eagles leading 39-34. 20 seconds remaining here in the third period. They look, try to take the last second here to the third period. Ball stolen away by Grant Cathy. His shot at the buzzer won't go, so we'll end the third period with the score of Ferris 39, Danville 34. Fourth period action, senior boys basketball here at Ted Lyon Gymnasium in Danville as Jay Trusty drives, kicks it back out, Danville trailing. Here as we start the fourth period. Thirty-nine, thirty-four. Ball out of bounds, last touch by the Eagles. Steven Ramirez shot up, no good. Rebound, Eagles, they push the ball down the floor. Pull up, 41-34. Seven point lead for the Eagles. Kevin Dominguez, try for three, won't go. Whistle and a tie ball's called. Possession arrow belongs to the Eagles. They inbound the ball with seven minutes remaining now. They push it all the way down the floor, layup good. 43-34 is your score. Oh, it's still in a foul against the Eagles. Jay Trusty at the line for the Little Johns. Timeout, Paris. We're back after the timeout. Jay Trusty at the line for the Little Johns. He knocks the first one down. 43-35's your score. 43-36. Jay Trusty almost makes a steal. He does knock the ball away where it's picked up by Grant Cathy. Whistle, blocking foul called on the Eagles. That will send Jay Trusty to the line, shooting a one and one. He'll try to cut this seven point lead by the Eagles down to five. Misses the front end of the one and one. <laughs> Whistle and a player control foul called against the Eagles. Gives the, gives the little Johns back the ball. 43-36 is your score. Six minutes, 25 seconds remaining here in the fourth period. Ball knocked out of bounds off the little John. Belongs to the Eagles. Six twenty remaining, 43-36 is your score. Well, after that basket, that extends the lead back to nine for the Eagles.
Ball knocked out of bounds, last touched. By the Eagles, B. Little John basketball. Long inbound pass. Kevin Dominguez for three. Forty-five, thirty-nine. Danville gets possession of the ball, trailing by six. Grant Cathy shot for three, no good rebound. Eagles, they'll push it. Grant Cathy chases it down, pushing foul. Going to be called on five of the Paris Eagles. That is his fifth personal foul. He fouls out of the ball game with five minutes, 14 seconds remaining here in the fourth period. That will send Grant Cathy to the line, shooting a one and one. As Grant was hustling down the floor, trying to cut off the pass for the, the Eagles. Whistle and a foul against the Eagles will send Mackenzie Garner to the line. As we've got Mackenzie Garner at the line shooting a pair of free throws. Five minutes, 11 seconds remaining here in the fourth period. Mackenzie's first is in the hole, gets good. Cutting the lead to five. He'll try to cut it to four with this free throw. And he does. 45-41 is your score. Eagles leading by four. Five minutes and five seconds as Kevin Dominguez knocks the ball out of bounds. against the Eagles. Little Johns will have the ball with 4.59 remaining, trailing by four. This trip down the floor, they'll try to whittle a little bit more off that Eagle lead. Ball stolen away by the Eagles. Whistle and a foul is going to be called. I believe it's going to be called on number two, Stephen Ramirez. I believe that's his third foul. Team's fifth foul. Whistle and a foul is going to be called on the Eagles. will send Jay Trusty to the line on the other end of the floor. Four minutes, 37 seconds remaining here in the fourth period. Timeout period. After the timeout, Jay Trusty at the line for the Little Johns. Short on his first one. He'll try to whittle the next one in and 
cut this four point lead by the Eagles down to three. And he does. 45-42 is your score, four minutes, 30 seconds remaining here in the fourth period. and a foul going to be called on Steven Ramirez. That's his fourth. Team sixth. 4-11 remaining. Eagles un inbound the ball underneath their own basket. Forty-seven, forty-two is your score. Four minutes remaining. Chambers Memorial Hospital, located 719 Detroit Avenue, is a proud sponsor of the Danville Little Johns Basketball. We offer timely professional service in our clinics to serve the health care needs of Danville and its surrounding communities. Chambers Memorial Hospital is a licensed 41-bed hospital with an emergency department that offers around-the-clock care. To learn more about the many offerings of Chambers Hospital, please visit our website at www.chambershospital.com or call us at 495-2241. Providing quality medical care for you and your family. Chambers Memorial Hospital, one of our sponsors. That allow us to make this production possible. Three minutes, 27 seconds as Jay Trusty inbounds the ball to Tanner Mantooth. Check back into the ball game for your little Johns. He's joined on the floor by number 12, Jay Trusty. Number 23 is Kevin Dominguez. 24, Mackenzie Garner. Whistle and a foul will be called on Jay Trusty. That's Jay's fourth. Team foul number seven. They missed the free throw, but lead 49-42. Three minutes remaining here in the fourth period. Kevin Dominguez for three. That's his fourth tray of the night. 49-45 is your score. Two minutes, 40 seconds remaining. Mackenzie Garner draws his third foul. Sends the Eagles to the line. And he banks the second free throw in. 51-45 is your score. Two minutes, 30 seconds remaining here in the fourth period. Jay Trusty's three won't go. Mackenzie Garner's fouled on the rebound. That's the 15th personal foul 
Paris will have as Mackenzie Garner steps to the line. Knocks the first free throw down. Back to a four point ball game, 51-47. Two minutes, 15 seconds remaining here in the fourth period. Gets their own rebound and put back their leads back to six. 53 47, 155 remaining. Kevin Dominguez is his, hits his fifth three of the night. Knocked out of bounds, last touch by Danville. Paris will inbound the ball with 1.32 on the clock here in the fourth period. Leading by three, 53 to 50. Tanner Mantooth comes out of there with the rebound. He pushes it up the floor, gives it to McKenzie Garner. His shot good. Out of bounds, last touch by the Eagles. Danville with possession, looks to take the lead. Just under a minute, Jay Trusty's three, no good. Battle for the rebound. Eagles come out of there with it. Kevin Dominguez called for the personal foul. That's his third, sends the Eagles to the line to shoot a pair of free throws with a one point lead, 41.8 seconds remaining. The Eagles will go to the line shooting a pair of free throws. Timeout Paris. And we're back after the Paris timeout. He's got one shot. And he misses. McKenzie Garner with the rebound. We've got a two point ball game. Dominguez inside to McKenzie Garner. He makes the shot. He'll go to the line to get, try to give Danville an advantage. Timeout, Danville. And we're back after the timeout. Mackenzie Garner to try to give the Little Johns a lead. Mackenzie misses a free throw tie ball game. 25 seconds remaining. The Eagles have the ball. Danville looking to make a big defensive stand here. Timeout, Paris. After the timeout, Paris inbounds the ball. 11 seconds remaining in a tie ball game. Shot up, no good. Ball goes out of bounds with five tenths of a second left on the clock. Paris will inbound it. We've got a timeout, Danville. 
After the timeout, we've got five tenths of a second on the clock. Tie ball game, 54 apiece. And the shot by the Eagles goes in at the buzzer. They win 57-54.